Well, the pandemic shut down this 106 year old movie theater, but it's found a second wind. Thanks to a small business grant, people from near and far are heading out to Carnegie for a show. News 9's Brittany Tulis witnessed the reopening. Families have been lining the block for a ticket and a show dog. Because after 18 months of being closed, it's showtime once again at the Liberty Theater. Even if we can't get in, we're at least going to try. Exciting moviegoers lining Carnegie's Main Street, waiting to sit back and enjoy the show for the first time since the more than century old theater shuttered because of COVID. We used to advertise as the Oklahoma's longest continuously running movie theater but I guess that's gone now. Put an asterisk, COVID. Jerry Applewhite bought the Liberty in the 70s from its original owner, closing it for the first time about 18 months ago. A small business grant helped Applewhite open his doors again Wednesday, and people living near and far came out in droves. And we heard this was opening, and then we were all real excited to come over. Over 600 people came out to catch a flick reopening day, but even more came for... Definitely some show dogs, probably quite a few of those. Oh, gosh. Uh, well, they are pretty much the world's best hot dog. The first day, it was just under 5,000. Some of the smallest film critics also have some advice for first-timers eating chili dogs in the dark. A little bit. It's hard not to spill chili off. <laughs> yeah, so that's why I always get a napkin with mine. Totally worth it, though. Apple White left almost speechless by the amount of people excited to step inside the 106 year old theater once again. Heartwarming. Everybody, people feel like this is their theater. I'm the owner, but it's theirs. Brittany Tulis, Oklahoma's own News 9.